Good morning, everyone. Welcome to vlog week day three. It is currently 7.15. Don't ask me why I'm up. I woke up at 6.30. I mean, I always need... Oh my gosh. I don't know. My fan is making really loud noises. I always need natural light, but I just woke up at 6.30 wide awake and I just laid in bed and I'm like, all right, I guess I'm going on a run. Today is Wednesday. We have a lot going on. I'm getting my hair done. My house is getting deep cleaned. What else are we doing? Um, I have therapy tonight. I just have some things I need to do, you know, around the house. Shocker, I know. In one of these vlogs, I'll talk more about my reading plan, but today, oh my gosh, this needs to be washed. Oh, maybe it stops up here somewhere, but I went to bed early and I guess you probably fell asleep downstairs. Anyways, yeah, so today is week five, day two or day one that means I have three weeks left so this is what I'm wearing on my run um, this is from Lululemon these are my favorite outdoor voices shorts I want like 15,000 shorts like this because I will be living in them this summer they're so comfortable and they're perfect to run in and yeah it's just great it's really hot in Texas I say that in every single vlog I mean you guys know this so <laughs> this early. I don't really eat much before I go work out in the morning just because it's just no but I have to eat something so I've been eating granola just straight up merely Elizabeth granola. Guys it's time for shots. A probiotic shot from Press Chasery and an espresso shot because I am tired so this one's not bad I don't think. Yeah it's fine. The combination between those two, just not good. Not good at all. All right, guys, back from my run. I've showered. Um, you they... need to tell them the alarm story? Oh, yeah, I do. So, Sav here is so excited for just life right now. Um, so, I went on my run for some reason. Like, you guys know, I woke up super early today and like, couldn't go back to sleep. And then I, like, go out for my run and all of a sudden I'm getting all these calls from Sav. And then I remember that I didn't disarm my security. So, like, when I went outside... You know, it all went off, and uh, she was, you know, was not happy. 7.30 in the morning. <laughs> I didn't go to bed till, like, 2 or 3. Well, no, 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 no. And, and the best part is that when I was this leaving, morning, oh this God. morning, it's, like, 7 a.m., I'm walking down the stairs, and she's walking up the stairs, and she's, like, going to sleep, and I'm going on my run, and we both go, yep. Yep. And yep. that was it. This has been passing. It was, like, yep. Yep. And we laughed so hard. Yeah. But yeah, so, like, she leaves <laughs> in... It's blaring, it's beeping everywhere. But then you kept calling me and I couldn't use my phone. I know, Coco runs over the bed and the light is flashing red and I'm like, oh my god, the cops are gonna come. I don't live here. I might get arrested. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm I might get arrested. Busy. And she's ignoring my calls to like disarm the system and so she disarms it, it's good. And then it starts beeping again. Because it beeps when it's rearming. Okay, I didn't know that, but it scared me. And so I called her again. And she was like, this is what's supposed to happen. And I was like, oh, okay. And I haven't been back to sleep since. Yeah. And it is now almost 1030. So Sab is like really happy. Oh my gosh. I'm not a morning person. You really just have never been a morning person. Never. You I want to be, but I just... Even from minutes. the time you wake up, it doesn't really matter what time you wake up. It takes you all two hours to like kind like of... Now I'm finally awake and it's been almost three hours. Yeah. So we're going to get a lot of land, we decided. Um, <laughs> my house is being clean right now. We'll talk about that later. It's actually really, really cool, especially for like Dallas people. But I just want my chia pudding that I've been eating like every day. So I'm gonna... See you there. <laughs> See you there. This lip balm, beauty kind of lip conditioner, I'm just like not impressed with. My cousin used to use that and she wasn't... I'm not impressed, but it's all I have right now because my summer Fridays went missing again. The one that I bought because the other one went missing. So I need to buy like 15 of them. Sounds like a personal problem. You know, I am so sorry that the alarm went off earlier as hell. But let's have a good day, okay? <laughs> Bus. My, my number one housewife. Housewife or bust. All right, guys, we stopped in La La Land. The best drink ow, ow. ever. Strawberry Fields. It's in every single vlog of mine at this point. Ooh, I don't sorry. know if this is in the right setting. Oh, it is. Sav goes. <laughs> what did they say where you said you two? Oh, he said enjoy. Oh, yeah. So, oh, yeah. So he was like, enjoy your drink. And I said, you too? But like, I had a weird look on my face. And he was like, thank you. And I was like, 
you're welcome. And then everyone just kind of looked at each other and we were like, yeah, okay. He was like, I'll enjoy my food and I eat it. And I was like, good. And yeah. that, that was that. Well, I walked in and he was like, welcome back. He's like, you brought your friends this time. I'm like, I brought her before, but I don't know if that was the same guy. There's two it guys. It was the guy that complimented my frat shirt. Oh yeah. There's, <laughs> there's two guys that look the same. Like they look very similar. But they're wearing masks. But they're wearing masks, and that's why it's so hard. Like if they weren't wearing masks, I would be able to under, like I yeah. would be able to tell them apart. But they yeah. look very similar. So what anyways. Is Coco's being right now? Can you just can you just appreciate this? This is pretty standard in a car for her. She loves cars and she's much better in them. Oh, so cute. She looks like a rat, guys. So okay, update on why Coco hasn't gotten groomed. So Basically, her vet shut down. I couldn't get her vet records, long story short. Um, so she has to go to a, a new vet here just to get like an update so they can prove, so I can have files to send her to the groomer. So she has a vet appointment tomorrow and then I'm gonna make it a groomer. I could probably make the appointment today, I guess, but. Yeah, we can do it when I get back home. She looks uh, home like I live there. Yeah, I, I do. I mean, you have a key. I was thinking I was gonna add you to the security app you so that you can control it. Because they asked me, the guy asked me if I could, if I wanted other people on it, and I didn't think about it, but I'll, I'll add you. After Mike's traumatizing I, We can't go through that again. No. Yeah, no. That's not happening again. All right, guys, I'm showing you before. It's now like 1230. Um, I've made it to my hair appointment. My hair is um, just like so dead and really needs some tragic work. I had to drive and pick up my pants for my grandma. She took a lot of my pants in so they would fit me better and, and she gave me vegetables from her garden, which is so cute. So I'm so tired even when I had that matcha and I had an espresso shot today, guys. So anyways, my sister's doing my hair. She does hair in Frisco. I don't know why I'm putting lip balm on because I'm going to put a mask on. This always happens to me. She does hair in Frisco. So if you guys live in the area, she's really good. And I'm not just saying that because she's my sister. So um, I'll have her Instagram like linked down below. You guys have seen her on all of my stuff, but. 2020. <laughs> <laughs> it literally looks like I'm in like going in a hospital. Welcome. Your hair looks different. Did you do something different? It's like more. I took it out. Oh, well, I'm in the color. Um, no, I'm getting my hair color tomorrow. So okay, we're gonna gonna go your color and I'll be back. I literally can't believe it. Maddie just tried to knock the oil on my freaking forehead again. But like it didn't seriously Maddie, are you sure that's enough? Yeah. I think I need more. Do I have more? Do you want the whole bottle? Yeah, I want the whole thing on my freaking forehead at this point. Oh my gosh, you're pretty Maddie, don't you want people to come get their hair done? It was the way that the angle. This is like a different type of hair. I thought that was so funny. Okay. Was funny. <sighs> okay cool. All right, guys. So I just finished doing my sister's hair. I don't know how to work this thing. Oh, I did it. Uh, look at me. What did you say? I just finished like applying your color. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Can this like zoom? Yeah. Cute Am I messing Maddie. it up? Ooh, it's so cool. What? It's like cute gloves. Thank you. I think that everything should be pink, you know? You took way Do you guys want to see my um, blow dryer? It's pink. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Okay, bye guys. This is so complicated. All right, guys, just got another Starbucks. I have not had Starbucks really at all in the past few like recently i've not had it at all but here we go Great job, Maddie. Oh yeah, it does look really good. Wow. Well, 2020. Back in the car, Germex time. Um, my hair feels so much better. This will just make my life better because I don't think my hair has ever been more dry or more dead in my life. So, just amazing. It's a very exciting day. While I was out, my dryer arrived. So we finally have a washer and dryer here guys who's excited i'm excited okay like this is 
literally the best day ever. Exciting things, guys. I am trying out a new laundry detergent. I asked you guys in our Facebook group. By the way, if you're not in the Facebook group, you need to be in the Facebook group. It's so much fun. So I asked you guys in the Facebook group what the best laundry detergent was because I want to be like known as that girl who's like clothes smell really good. Um, and so many of you guys said this. It's a little bit pricier, so I'll let you guys know um, from Amazon. But I'm going to smell it, actually. Oh, it smells really good. So I got it on Amazon. Guys, I'm back and my house. Got deep clean today. Um, oh my gosh, it looks incredible. You know when you just feel amazing? Like, I cannot tell you. Oh my gosh. And just like so many things. It needed a deep clean so bad. So, it was really great. It was Blue Door Cleaning, any of my Dallas gals. Um, that's where you need to go to get your house cleaned. They donate 5 to 30% of all proceeds. They... So basically, they donate a portion of every cleaning to either like a foster care organization or um, people who are out of sex trafficking. So it's like incredible. So if you are hiring anyone to clean, you should hire Blue Door Cleaning. I like love them because they give back so much. Coco, you are a crazy girl. And my house looks absolutely amazing. They're they so freaking nice and cool. So anyways, my house looks the best it's probably ever looked since I moved in here. Um, I will have them linked down below and stuff, especially if you guys are North Dallas people. If you guys are North Dallas people, yes, you guys should hire them because you basically are donating and then also getting your house cleaned. So it's a really good like win, you know? Coco is very clingy. Something else I wanted to mention, I asked them to like send over more stuff because I just love them. Something else I wanted to mention is that they allow clients to nominate foster parents and they'll go and clean foster homes for free. So, um, they're the best. You guys should check them out. Really, really great. Um, I will have them linked down below. All right, guys, this would also be a good time to mention that I do have a Dallas-specific, like, Facebook group. If any of you guys live in the area, we've been doing threads of, like, favorite places and, like, best dog groomers and stuff like that. Um, I just shared, like, all of Blue Door on there as well just because, like, they actually live here. Um, Coco, you were so cute. So, anyways, I'm really hungry. Actually, what was I going to say? There was something else I was gonna say. Morgan Yates just texted me and asked me for my country playlist. Can you believe this? This is the best thing that ever happened to me. She has always hated country, made fun of me for it, and now here we are, guys. All right, guys, Liz is here because she is shooting some photos in the office, but I got a package from Dr. Brandt. Very, very exciting. This is the, I didn't even read it. Wait, no, I read it somewhere. Back to balance. I don't even know where I'm. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Calm the chaos. Okay, so we have a cleanser. Oh, redness relief cream. This is going to be the best thing ever. If anyone remembers when I was obsessed with Dr. Jart's like tiger grass stuff, actually my little brother probably would really want this too. Recovery sleep mask. I'm actually going to try these like really today. I'm going to get these out later. But um, yeah, this is exactly what I need. That's like the only skin problem I have is redness. So... This is my dinner. I mean, my lunch. I'm so freaking hungry. Oh my gosh. Incredible. Really just incredible. I'll give you a really quick grocery haul. I got my stuff delivered from Instacart. I just realized though, maybe I forgot to add the ground pork, but I don't think so. So maybe they were out. Um, anyways, I got ground pork, my favorite marinara sauce. Um, I want to make bolognese, but I'm going to have to go get pork before I do that. Celery carrots, also for the bolognese broccoli because I got salmon. I haven't made broccoli and salmon in probably like two or three months and now like it just sounds so good. I've had a really weird appetite lately as I've mentioned 15 times. Honeycrisp apples, Cheez-Its, goldfish. This is really good pasta for bolognese. Um, I, guys don't even ask. I literally don't know why. This is the problem with, um, with Instacart is that you just see random things like why would I I would have never ever purchased those um, then some Oh shoot totally need pasto. Oh, and I got pesto, but it didn't come so they must have been out of a lot of stuff My favorite yogurts ever and then kind menus. So these are really good for like before a run in the morning That would have been nice for this morning, but that's what I got um, flavor. Oh my gosh. I totally skipped over the snack section um goldfish baked i've heard these are really good um i mean flavor blasted cheesy pizza i'm so sorry guys and extra toasty cheez it's that's what i heard is really good there 
therapy tonight has been canceled, so I'm watching Stuff in the Den. It really just truly, I say this all the time, but it really truly finally feels like summer. Even though it's, you know, I don't even think it's technically summer yet. You guys get what I'm saying, okay? It feels good. And guys, I'm gonna end today's vlog just because I don't want it to be too long. Hope you guys enjoyed. Daily vlogging is so fun, but it's harder for me because I'm used to doing vlogs that are like an hour long. But I'll see you guys tomorrow. Also, leave questions down below. I'll do a little Q&A in tomorrow's vlog. So leave questions down below because that's where I'm gonna be pulling them from. But love you guys so much and I'll talk to you guys soon.